This morning's coffee with us with Haley Atwell and Matthew McFadden. And this Saturday interview is furnished by Stars. All right, folks. Matthew, Haley, welcome to WJZ. Good morning. How are you? Good morning. Very well. Hello. How are you? Thanks for having us. Well, we're going to talk about <laughs> we're going to talk about Howard's end in a second, but off the air, I said, "Hey, you guys ready to go?" And you and Haley started chuckling again like that. You guys are pretty relaxed and having a good time we with the satellite. Shared a look too. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh, we're pretty we started relaxed. thinking quite early this morning. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> we're ready. We're very happy to yeah. be here. We're raring to yeah, go. It's over excitement. Yeah, and we're in New York, which is very exciting. How long have you been at this today? Were you, were you, were you like your first, your last, in the middle? You are our first. Very oh. first. first. So of the you're going to help warm us up a little bit into this. We have a full yeah. day of press, but you, you've got us right at the beginning where we're still kind of rabbit in headlights, not quite sure what we're going to say. <laughs> okay, <laughs> no pressure, take it away. Yeah. yeah, well, we're talking about um, <laughs> Howard's End, which is a classic novel. It's been made into a movie before. So, kind of, what was your take doing these characters? Well, uh, I was, I'd seen the film. Uh, and loved it when I was quite young. Um, I think just before I went to drama school. So when the script, when Kenneth Lonergan's script came through, it was really thrilling. If, uh, just for that reason, because I was familiar with the film and loved it. And then it was such a joy to read. Yes. It was such a brilliant thing to read uh, that it, it was sort of a no-brainer. Even though I just played a lot of Englishmen in Tweed, or I played an Englishman in in this um, Victorian cop show called Ripper Street. So I was kind of didn't want to do a period piece particularly, but this, this came along and it was it was just wonderful. So. Yeah, I felt the same. The the traction of having Kenny Lonergan uh, with this sort of material just give it gives it a lightness of touch and made it for me have just. Uh, a real kind of vitality to it. Um, yeah, so similar to Matthew. It's just, he, for me, was the big pull. I'm going to ask this question to Haley with Matthew. If you want to jump on it too, that's fine. Haley, you've done such a variety of roles just in the past. I'm just going to throw out five years. But the, 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 from Cinderella to the, to the Hendrix Bobbick, I can't wait to get my hands on, to, you know, the, the Marvel, Marvel Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. And now, all of a sudden, a period piece like this, as an actor or an actress, is this what it's all about? All of a sudden, opening your mail and going, something new, something different. Yeah, it, it's not so much um, a particular genre rather than just what I felt was a really good piece of storytelling. So if the writing's fantastic, it, for me as an actor, it gives you more, you have more choices to make and it's an intellectual and an emotional challenge to f kind of hit these notes in, in this beautiful piece of work, which we know is a classic novel, but also a, a very beloved film. Um, so it's just kind of the richness of the material as opposed to it being a particular genre, a period piece or a superhero movie. Um, and it, yeah, it kind of required for me to kind of, um, you know, try to get out of the way and, and just do a good job of what Kenny had created and, um, and to be able to work with Matthew again. Third time. Third time. Third oh, time. Third time. Oh, so you guys know each away. other. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It helps because it, you know, breaks the ice. You just can yeah. have a laugh and have a giggle on set. All right, cool. <laughs> About 30 seconds left. So how do we do? Have we set the table for I you? Know. I mean, One down. You, are the headlights rubbed? Are you ready to go to the interview number two through 98? Yeah, I feel quite warmed up. <laughs> yeah, you were freezing cold. I really was, yeah. I was very, yeah. <laughs> they, we're, we're the Thank you very we're, much. We're the ultimate <laughs> opening act. I know. There you go. All right, the headliner is yeah. coming up soon, folks. Be sure and tip your bartenders <laughs> and waitresses, and we'll be right back. Hey, listen, thanks so much for being with us. Congratulations and, on Howard's End. And really good luck mm -hmm. to you. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. Bye Great bye. talking Cheers. to you.